Warning, the following video contains nothing but stupidity. If you do not like comedy or want to keep your brain cells intact, do not watch this video. Hergi, hergi, welcome one and all to Rogue Legacy. I am your announcer, of Hero Wolf, and today we are going to be playing this game. Okay, guys, but feel Wolf here, and uh, today we are be going to be playing Rogue Legacy, as, as I've said. This is an awesome side-scrolling game that's randomly generated. I'll explain all the features and stuff as we play along. But uh, first thing we need to do is to start a new profile. So let's just uh, switch over acting selected. Let's delete it. Are you, do you want to delete your save file? Confirm. Are you absolutely sure? Double protection. Yes. So let us see here. My duties are to my family. And yes, I'm going to be narrating this part. There are only two lines. Come on. I have to narrate this. This is awesomeness. Okay. And so, continue on. But I am loyal only to myself. You see, you didn't expect that now, did you? And yes, I did not auto-tune that or anything. That is my actual voice doing that. So, ha. But you can't do that with your voice now, can you? No. Ha. Yeah, so you may be able to hear me with my controller. Sorry if you can. But, uh, anyways. Let's just jump higher and higher. And just kill all of these people. Uh, programming. So, Kenny Lee. Thank you, Kenny. You are amazing, because this game is amazing. So let's do this awesome walk style. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> this looks like just derpy walking. So here's an enemy to kill. Before he could even attack, that's how fast we are. We're like the speeding bullet. Faster than light. Faster than day. Faster than everything. So let us just destroy all the stuff. Get all as many of these coins as you can. So these coins can be used to actually buy upgrades. Uh, and if you're wondering how I'm doing these things, screen cues. There you go. Because this is basically a little tutorial of how to play, so I thought I'd do it just so that way you guys uh, know how I'm playing this. Uh, down. There we go. So let's just get that. Had to go for that money. Gosh. Those are like the hardest things to do, those attacking downs. But who knows, who cares, let's just continue jumping up here. But this controller is amazing, I just got it today, guys. And this is such an amazing controller, it's like, it only cost me 20 bucks. And this thing's just downright awesome. It looks just like an Xbox controller, it's made by Logitech. So right here, we are a knight, so we want to protect our king. But you know what? Screw the king! And we kill him. Da da da. And that is why you are now sworn to do something in this castle, so to the manor. No, we don't want to go there, and that dummy's mouth is moving, what the? And even makes noises? <laughs> what did I do to deserve this? Best name ever for a dummy. So let us continue in here. Ooh, look, a creepy cave with your bridge. Who wouldn't want to go in here on first glance? We are now building this cave. Because, you know, if people build caves right before you walk in, let us destroy these chandelier candle thingies. Yes, I know those are candles. Do not judge me in my insanely awesomeness. Journal entry numero uno. Treason! An assassin has wounded my father, the king. To bring order back to the kingdom, we have sent our siblings on a quest to save and Together we will venture into the cursed woods and enter the castle hands and... Ah. This cursed castle has stood on the edge of the woods since the time of immortality, but rumors say that within it dwells an item which can cure almost any ailment. I totally butchered that. Okay, tonight I will go to Head Start over my brothers and sisters and set forth on the quest to lay asleep. To fail this quest would be an embarrassment to my name. So yeah, that's a little backstory or whatever, so interpret that however you want. I'm going to say that I was a rule who died because he ate too much bread. How did I interpret that? I don't know. But hey, it makes for an interesting story now, doesn't it? Uh, this room seems hard. And, wow, that took me a while. And, no, no, not one of those little guys. They, they don't deserve my death. They don't deserve to die by my hand. Gosh, the guy's a little knockback for his sword. So, um, this is just destroy some of these chandeliers. A basic house game where it says you don't always play as this guy, which is why I said, wow, this guy has no knockback. Because, uh, basically, whenever you die, like I just did, totally meant to do that, so I was talking about it. Basically, it says that he's died by a blank, which is a skeleton. Those are the enemies that he's kill he has killed. 
And then uh, it gives little words of wisdom right there by Sir Lee's parting word, which were Sir Lee's parting words, and then choose a hair. So now, from Sir Stanley, we go right here, and we get to choose between things. And as you can see on the side, they each have a class, a trait, and a spell. And the spell basically just does different things. And the traits now is what you want. And right here, this guy is, he has two left hands, and he can't cast spells properly, and he's also bald. Uh, this guy has no peripheral vision, and you have trouble reading things because you have dyslexia. That is actually an awesome one. We're just going to do that one because of the derpiness of it. So let us buy this, this smithy. Yay. We now have a smithy, and he'll be our blacksmith that will fix things for us. And then let's health up. And then that's about everything that we can do. Uh, let's just talk to him really quick. Hey, <laughs> uh, this is going to be fun trying to read. Welcome, hero. Maybe you can help me. I used to be the greatest blacksmith in all the lands, but one day the something of this something something my smithy and stole all my blueprints. Without those blueprints, I can only make chivalry and stuff. <laughs> uh, please bring back any blueprints. You find, and I can build the most amazing equipment ever, ever! Because you, know, you need two efforts on that. At a price, of course. <laughs> you know, because charity doesn't exist. Medieval times, you know. And they see me rolled in. They hating. Everybody gotta see me walking nice. One must pay the toll. Wow. This thing is so. It looks so weird and stuff. Uh, confirm. Basically, what that guy does is he takes your money because, you know, and because you can't have your hair's money with you when you enter this cave, so you want to spend as much of it as possible. So right now we are building, 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 because, you know, you have little dwarven people that live in the code of these games that build things for you in the background. And this game is flat out, tells you that, and oh my gosh. Ah, this is going to be fun. Try to do, uh, whatever, just take two damage and... and Instantly die. Now that was a hard room, and of course that was the very first one that we get. So let's choose our hair. Ooh, he looks bad. You can't see in 3D. Oh, you are insane. Oh, that one's a fun one. Let's see if what this guy has. Anything close up is blurry. Oh, that one. Oh, that one's straining your eyes. I'm not gonna do that. We're gonna do this one, which is you are insane, in which you will just randomly start imagining enemies and stuff. And like right there, this stuff uh, that actually doesn't. Wait, does that exist? I forget. I don't think that stuff was supposed to be there. Who knows? Uh, actually, now I'm thinking it is, so now I feel like an idiot. But uh, let's continue right here. Building, building, building. And so, uh, you'll notice as I go in here, there'll be enemies that aren't actually there, but they can't attack you. And you'll just start, like, right here. I don't think all these enemies are actually here. I think some of them may just be... Man, this is a weird room with all these enemies. This may actually be a legitimate room, and we're not actually insane for this one, but we'll only find out once we attack them all. Gosh. Wow. Oh, well, we don't get to find out if we're insane. Uh, you see, this is a game of death, and I'm not going to say that this is a let's fail or anything, because this is how the game is going to be. You're just gonna, we're just going to keep dying and dying. That's just how it is. Oh. Giantism. That is awesome, and you are a basketball player in the medieval times, which doesn't exist because you're that awesome. So now you can hit Y to block all the incoming attacks. Wonderful. Let's exit here and look at me. I'm bigger than Smithy. How do you feel now, Smithy? I'll stab you in the heart. Die. Let's continue. E even when you're big, it still looks derpy walking like that. Uh, let's go right in here. Let us continue on. We are building, 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 building. Let us see here. We have a shan candle. Not a chandelier. I ain't that stupid yet. Where am I? Who knows? It's late at night. Uh, wait. Did that just pass right through my head? I'm assuming it did. Because, you know, my head doesn't exist apparently. Oh my gosh, look at that knockback and that critical hit. Oh my. Oh my gosh, this is awesome to be giant. This is honestly one of my favorite things to be is giant. Just because it's so easy to kill everything. And oh my gosh. Nope. Critical. Let's run back here. Ah, dang it. One more for them. 
<laughs> there we go. Oh, oh yeah. Forgot regenerate health when you leave the room. Wonderful. And we're dead. This is literally going to be the game. If you don't like the death, then this may give you nightmares. My little boy. Ooh. Let's see. Try to remember where you are. Oh gosh. <laughs> uh, I've never played with Alzheimer's. <laughs> Let's see what this does. <laughs> Maybe we'll start like having delusions or something. I'm not sure. Uh, hit him for good luck. He's the trading dummy. Uh, let's go right here. Money. Get rid of that. It's 30 gold for Pete's sake. Come on. We don't need that. <laughs> I can't. And maybe it's just one of the ones that doesn't do anything. But with some with a description like that, I'm hoping it does something. Because that's going to be funny if it, we just randomly forget stuff. And, like, we just get teleported into, like, an island of, like, like it just a desolate island or something. That's going to be entertaining. But, uh, yeah, so... I really want to do a series in this game, just because it's a really fun game to play, and also because this lady right there is wanting to attack me, or a man, who knows, that looks like a, it may just be a boo that is deformed a little bit and doesn't want to show its face, so it's covering it up, and so that's how that came about, because you know, everything we have to relate to Mario now, uh, I don't want to touch him, I don't think that you technically have to, but whatever. Let's attack that guy. Come at me. You can't get me. Because I am invincible. So. Let, let, run, run. Ha ha ha. We get your old gold. My question is, why is that? Why in all the video games does there all, do the enemies always have to have gold on them? Like, you'd think that there'd be at least one enemy that was just, like, didn't get the memo and just forgot to bring gold for the enemy. It's like, oh, guys, just so you know, uh, yeah, our arch nemesis is going to show up today, and he's going to kill us all, so we better have some gold ready for him for when we die. Uh, yeah, so I hope you all get this memo, because, you know, he's going to be mad if we don't, like, honestly, like, where do they get all this gold and stuff? I mean, just having crates, if I were the ghost, I'd probably get all this money together and start remortalizing ourselves. I mean, this is a world of magic, apparently. I mean, look at that. You just put that there and you're about to jump there. Nope. Just get teleported. I mean, if you can do that, heck, you can bring ghosts back to life. I'd just... I'd start just saving up all the money in here that I'd find. And then just spend it in order to make myself a mortal again. Then again, these guys are immortal and I died. Once again, that's how this game works. You just die, 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 die. So, are you ready to die? Ooh, chickens freak you out, and there are actually chickens in this game, so you remember things with extreme clarity. She get, chickens freak you out. So energetic. Eh, let's choose that guy. Or girl, or whatever. Whoever you are, you little scum. So, equip up. Let's see what we got here. Uh, let us go over. Oh, Enchantress. Eh, let's choose you. We need some more magical powers in order to take over the kingdom. And we unlock that. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, let's just get mag magic damage up, and then we only have 20 left, so let us continue. Running, running, running. And we poop. You couldn't enter the castle, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we know. Okay, so let us kill some people. Let's see here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we are running definitely a lot faster now. So let us go up into here. And absolutely positively now. Oh, there's a frost mage. This is our first one tonight. And we are going to murder her. Now I have regret. I just killed someone. Heck, for all I know, they could have been innocent and just wanted, like, an autograph or something. And they never said they wanted to hurt me. Maybe they're just doing it in defense because they see me with my sword out and they're just like, we're going to die if we don't fight this guy. So maybe you're the bad guy. Maybe you honestly are. But we're not ever going back in that room, so let's not murder. 8A1. And you know we're not going back in that room because we just died. Death, 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 death. That's the game. It, instead of the game life, this is the game of death. Welcome to the game of death. Ooh, no foot pulse. Don't know what that means. Can't seem 3D. You know what? This one seems interesting. You see, I'm not choosing these based on effectiveness. I'm just seeing what the heck happens. <laughs> but, uh, 
I was actually not going to play this game, guys, for this video. I was originally going to play Chivalry Medieval Warfare, but it was lagging the heck up. And so, I'm I'm trying to get that game to work. Hopefully it will. But who knows, we could just have some candles here. And we have a chair here. And we have other things here, so... Let's see. Oh my lord. Uh, no. Uh, evil eye, we don't want to face you. So we want to go right here. And let us knock back these enemies before they're able to murder us. Uh, fire mage, you're me. And also, guys, I was uh, also thinking about possibly doing a face cam while doing these. And, uh, I don't know, I'm still thinking about it just because I don't know if I want to reveal my face yet to the world and all that stuff, but I know that it would make these videos a lot more enjoyable because I can make really weird and funny faces and have really weird reactions to some of the things that happen. So, uh, I can't wait to actually be able to do that. I think I may set that as my goal for 50 subs. So, if we can get 50 subs, I will finally start showing my face in these videos. And hopefully you guys aren't creeped out by my insane beauty. I mean, yeah. I, I, I don't know on a scale of 1 to 10 how wonderfully beauty, beautiful I am. So, sorry, ladies. But, wow. This is like the best spot to be. And, boom. He, he just can't get us. I, I feel really bad right now. I feel like I'm cheating the game. Just standing right here. But, die, die, die. Uh, no. Maybe that's why they left it in. Maybe that's why. Just to troll me. Make me feel like I was doing good. Hey, hey, kid. Y yeah, you want to feel good in the game? Hey, you're dead. You are a fan of the man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh gosh, this game is weird. Ooh, clumsy. Yes, I want to be one of the seven dwarves. Or, no, clumsy wasn't one of them. Gosh darn it, me. I was supposed to be a Disney fan. Christ. I know I was thinking that too, because I recently read an article about, like, rejected seven dwarves. Like, names and stuff. Or, wait. Was clumsy? Now we're gonna feel like an. No, clumsy wasn't one. I, I know for a fact. Hopefully. Gosh, if my brain's not working. If Clumsy was one, I'm going to feel like a big idiot right now. But, don't think Clumsy was one. That special dog, Dopey, Grumpy. <laughs> now I'm just trying to rename all seven words in my head. Wow, why am I thinking so much about this? Whatever. And if I'm wrong, you guys will correct me and then I'll just feel stupid and be like, Wow, I shouldn't make that mistake again. Then we'll move on from there. So, hopefully I'm not that stupid. And if I'm wrong, guys, please don't. Please, please don't make me feel bad. Heck, we're recording this at midnight, so come on. Give me a break. <laughs> My brain's not fully working right now, anyways. So let us go right there. We I can start recording things during the day, gosh. My brain would actually be working then. Let's run through here, like no one's business. Get it twice. Oh, no. Defeat all enemies. Gosh, these rooms are always the hardest. Oh gosh. You see what I was saying? They're always the hardest. I know that I'm not. Uh, this game is going to be hard to make a let's play of because I keep on being silent when I'm in a mood. In which I start using here, and oh gosh, I chose one where things are getting blurry nearby. So, just a tip: don't look at my character. Ugh, <laughs> that is horrible. Ah, this guy hurt my eyes. This is gonna be our last guy for tonight, just because it's almost going to be a 20 minute long video, and we don't want to be that long, do we? So let's continue in here. Thank gosh, the loading screen is on blurry. Uh, Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so hard to play as. Ah, oh, this hurting my eyes so much. Ah. <laughs> Dar a new game. Well, now we know for the future never to pick anyone who's gonna have a blurry vision problem. Gosh. Ah, uh, this is horrible. Ah. Uh, it, it hurts my eyes. I don't know why. Ho hopefully, I'm not blaming what this is happening to. Because otherwise, I'm gonna feel weird. But. Gosh, this is, for some reason, this is really, like, straining my eyes to look at. And, oh, chest, money, 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 we always need money, money. 
trying hard to be entertaining. <laughs> you guys haven't guessed any heck. I am so dang tired. I got in. I didn't go to bed last night till like one in the morning and now I'm staying up till midnight now and I still have to edit this video and get it out. Oh gosh. This is gonna be interesting then I also missed the stream today which I'm gonna have to make up tomorrow. <laughs> and I listen to you children. If you're going to do YouTube expect a little bit of a headache. Gosh, it's hard scheduling things, but hopefully I can get back to daily schedule, or maybe every other day I'll start doing. Since school is starting up, I don't want to be overloading myself, because I know I'm going to have a lot of schoolwork. I'm going in, and I'm going to be a sophomore soon, and oh uh, gosh, I can't wait for that. I absolutely just can't wait, gosh. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so... Let's see how long this drive is. Well, of course on the last guy, I was like the worst vision. I'm lasting like the longest I've ever lasted. It's probably because I have increased health or whatever. Or at least I think I do. Not really paying attention to that, just paying attention to my little blurry man on the screen. But Man, but Okay, on the subject of videos, I know I mentioned this chivalry thing a while ago. Or maybe I didn't, I forget. I'm just gonna mention it again anyways, uh, I was going to do Chivalry Medieval Warfare instead of this, but I uh, couldn't get to work without lagging a little bit, so I'm gonna try to do that tomorrow, but, gosh, I'm really, really wanting to play Skyrim for you guys, because I can record it perfectly well and everything, but, need to be partnered, IGN or somebody, but, can't get that partnership just yet. Have to wait till I have a lot of subs and a lot of views, and hopefully you guys will be able to help me get there one day in the future. And gosh, I just ran out of there like a dummy. Gosh darn it. Let's just get the stuff really quick. Get the gold and run. Wow, this guy's really hard. <laughs> Gonna say really easy, but nope. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. Here's Rogue Legacy. Hope you guys like this new series. This is gonna be episode one, and let's see what we should call it. I don't know because I just come up with these things at the end. But uh, yeah, I'm rambling on now. So thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Hope you like this new series. Hope you guys like looking at my failure right there and my statistics and whatever. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.